Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how I achieved my life-saving wash and go. This was one of the first styles that actually worked for me during my TWA phase after so many tries. Between the defined curls and the illusion of a tapered cut, this was an easy choice for a go-to style. Here's how I did it. For this video, I started on co-washed hair. For moisture, I'm applying my favorite leave-in conditioner by Karen's Body Beautiful. For curl definition, I'm using olive oil eco styler gel. I'm also using a spray bottle with water in it to saturate my hair. The technique for this style is rather simple. First, I finger part a medium section of hair and secure the remaining hair with clips. I then use my fingers to detangle the area. Following that, I saturate the hair with water very generously. This is one of the important steps. To complete the section, I rake Eco Styler Gel through. It is very important that you rake in order to break up the clumps formed by the Eco Styler Gel. Be sure to add enough to get rid of the frizz, but not so much that the section is a big weighed down clump. That wasn't so bad, let's take another look. Finger detangle, saturate with water, rake gel through. Finger detangle, saturate with water, rake gel through. I continue those steps until the back of my hair is complete. Then I head to the front. Once I get to the front, precision is a little more important. I personally like to have a side part, so I part the front of my hair into two sections. I then secure each section with clips and add two duckbill clips above and below the part to make sure it stays until I get to defining it. Once I get to the areas around the part, I make sure I define the part and edges by smoothing while I rake. I then add a little more gel at the part and add the duckbill clips back.
here's a look at the curl definition. Just a few more steps to the finished product. One thing that always annoyed me about having hair cut the same length all around was the awkward length of the back of my hair. It always looked like I had a mullet. I found a solution to that, the tapered illusion. Just a few bobby pins is all it took. Here, I'm pinning up the back of my hair. The trick is to first apply the pins at the nape to raise the hair, and then apply the pins on top of the curls. I do this for the back right, back left, and then the back middle. Now I'm removing the duckbill clips, picking the top of my hair at the root for more volume, and laying my baby hair using Cream of Nature Perfect Edges, and I'm done. When I'm finished, I have a cute, sleek TWA wash and go. To refresh in the morning, I just use a spray bottle to saturate my hair. I don't touch it at all. 15 minutes later, it's back to life and I'm out the door. watching. Good luck.